Ear canal, the outside two thirds of the ear canal is where there are some small minor um, uh, wax glands and they will be poking their heads up through the skin as you're healing. And as they do, it'll tickle and it'll feel like there's a spider or an ant crawling in there. But it's in fact just, and it'll be laying down a thin layer of wax. You can see here's the bony part of the canal and there's just skin and bone here. It's very difficult for the body to repel infection from in this area here. And so that's why there should be wax here to protect it from getting in. Your wound is right here. Your wound is, it's either, um, it's underneath the skin, there's some fluid collection there, and that could either just be a little hematoma, some blood collection, or it could be an infection. So if it starts hurting you more, please let me know. Um, if you want, <clears throat> I can call you in some ear drops, but the, the, the drops you want to do is cortisporin otic suspension. It's called like neomycin, polymyxin, blah, 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 blah. Ear drops, it has some steroids in it too. If you use those drops, if it's not getting better, it will help to clear the bacteria from your ear canal. I do like one week of it, twice a day. Um, uh, and then you have to stop the Q-tip and it'll be tough. You'll be like holding your hand back. No, no, don't scratch your ear. Here, I'll show you. It's a true story. It's like, no, no, don't do it. Oh my gosh, I have to do it. Just talking about it makes my ear itchy and I want to rub it. I want to rub it. You got to not touch it. For about a month or so and the itchiness goes away forever. See, I actually wear glasses. Um, anyway, that's that's my thoughts on that. Let me know if you want the cortisporin drops called in for you. I'll need your information, your pharmacy and stuff. Um, but Neomyce and Plymixin cortisporin eardrops. It's kind of a long, crazy word. It'll, it'll clear all the infection in your ear. Then let those minor wax glands come back. Hope that helps. You may also have an allergy. It's another thing to cause itchy ears. All right.